Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with another video over on Ark Survival Ascended. And this is about the saddle durability release in Ark Survival Ascended. Now people are freaking out and they're saying the saddles are broken, blah, blah, blah. Things, they have a durability, so it means you need to focus on the actual. Um, you can see this one's at 99 out of 100. Um, but th they're saying that saddles are breaking left and right, right? Now, that is... Uh, technically possible but i went ahead and tested it in every way that i know how and i'm gonna tell you what it actually is the saddle durability update whether it really is a thing to be scared of or not if you don't mind smash that like button leave a comment below for the algorithm and consider subbing to the channel because it helps me a ton i'm very close to 100k and that's what i've been going for from the start so Anyways, this is a Triceratops. All saddles have some form of durability on them. Now you can see that primitive saddles have a 100 durability. And then if I was just to like, for example, spawn in high level saddles, let's say I want to spawn in that right there, right? If I want to spawn in these high level saddles, I can see that their durability on some of them can be like 1728 with insane armor and stuff like that, right? So yes, they technically have dura. The lowest that I have ever seen one drop in the many, many, many types of tests that I have ran is 1%. That's it. I've seen, okay, that's not entirely true. I saw it draw to 98 one time. I don't know if I did enough damage or what happened with it, um, but I just wanna show you what I mean by that, right? So basically your SATA durability doesn't seem, and if it does lose anything, like I don't see anything right now that could cause enough damage to a saddle to truly cause quick damage to be concerned about. I think it's meant to be something that's an overtime issue instead of something that's actually a durability issue, like, oh my goodness, it's gonna go away. Now I'm sure they might release dinosaurs in this upcoming few patches where they're actually gonna be concerned about what's going on, right? And they are, uh, these dinosaurs are no longer able to, by the way, they fixed the C4 glitch, which is pretty cool, but that's a side note. So uh, there's gonna be dinosaurs that can shred what's actually going on. So check this out. So that should have just taken, you would assume, a little bit of durability. That's that's a good chunk of uh, stuff right there, C4. However, the durability stayed at 99, right? Now I've shot this thing with turrets. I've shot this thing with rockets. I've shot it with an Arthra Plura. I've turned on turrets for like 20 minutes. You can see this right here, right? I'm gonna run away from this so because it's loud in my ear and I don't want to deal with that right now. You know what, why not? I'll just go ahead and add in some fun here, right? So here's me shooting this as well. So I'm the one technically damaging it. We've had C4, I've hit it with a Giganotosaurus. I've hit it with something that's supposed to shred or rumor had it was this was the original armor shredder, right? It doesn't do anything um, in my opinion. So this thing has just been like lit up with all kinds of stuff. I'll swing a sword at it, right? Because some people are gonna say, oh, Teach, you should swing a sword. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and do that too. Why not, right? So here's me swinging a sword as well. So this thing has taken damage from just about every kind of thing that I can possibly think of. And here's my point behind all of that, right? It's still at 99 durability. Now, it's possible that the armor rating has something to do with how much you run the dino or how much you walk the dino or spend time on the dino. But some of the dinos that I have flown around with and distance wise that I've covered in this game has been astronomical. So I have not seen any major changes in the amount of uh, durability that have caused actual concern for me, right? Now there are easy fixes, right? If you've got enough stuff to make a saddle, you've probably got enough stuff to repair it because it's like a quarter of the cost. And notice how I'm using this guy and we're just going for an adventure right now. There's no value. So let's go ahead and check it out, right? Did it go down? It did not. So. I have hit it with Arthra Plura. I've run things over with Giganotosauruses. I've gone over things with uh, Therizinosaurus. Do I know that the durability does go down? Yes, I do. But I'm telling you, you have nothing to worry about for the time being, unless someone finds something that shreds saddles, literally in the description says shreds armor or shreds saddles, right? There is nothing to be afraid of because as of right now, I've been using this trike for, I don't know, I've tested probably about three hours of stuff and all kinds of stuff has not given me any result. The lowest saddle I've seen in the drop to is 98 overall. So yes, the durability is something to be thinking about for sure when it comes to saddles. 
However, it is not something that I would put very high on my need to be concerned about list because it's not damage based. It doesn't seem like when the durability goes down that the damage goes up. It's just more of like a warning if you want to think of it that way because the durability just doesn't even really think about going down. I've taken a level 100 million Giganotosaurus and one chomp to trike to see if that maybe like instant tapped the saddle. I picked the saddle up and that saddle was then just 99. I'll show you what I mean. Here's the uh, Giganotosaurus that I was talking about. Here's the saddles that I chomped. You can see there's the 98 one. And this one you can see has gone down to 1606. So it does actually do based on damage. Um, but we're talking like you've got to be doing such astronomical damage numbers. I'll show you what I mean, right? I'll bring this Giganotosaurus over there. The amount of damage that you have to be doing to something is what's the damage on this guy, right? His damage is 3,605. So we're talking like end to end game official servers damage, right? That's the kind of damage that we're talking to do a small amount of damage to this uh, Triceratops. So I'm gonna go ahead and unclaim him. It's gonna be crazy loud and I am sorry about that. But as you can see, this guy is gonna go ahead and start hitting and there we go so he went ahead and shredded that thing we picked up a 98 oh wait a minute that's not the saddle did he just drop the saddle really he just kind of drop it like that okay um you can see this is at 96 now so he did take some damage but what i want you to keep in mind this saddle just from a giganotosaurus took about i mean what was that 66 million health or something like that 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 uh, triceratops had so the amount of damage that you have to take in order for the durability to be can like considered dangerous is so high it's almost a joke does it go down yes it does go down you should look at it but you can use unless they took these out pliers they took them out for the time being i don't think i'm spelling it wrong so you'll have to put it back inside wherever you can in order to fix it wait till the pliers come out wait pliers come out scorched earth i think they came out scorched earth so you can use um just put it back in the just keep an eye on it that's all i'm saying right it is technically a thing the durability update is a thing but the amount of damage and distance and everything you're going to have to travel to notice it is so insane that i recommend just keeping an eye on it every now and then it's not something where you should uh be super concerned but keep your eye on it for certain so hopefully this helps you out and uh i wish i had more answers for you other than the fact that it takes a ridiculous amount of damage to actually kill a saddle um, i haven't seen it done and i've attacked these things for a few hours now and i've seen a total of like four ish damage um on the durability so just keep an eye on it it doesn't seem to change the damage overall it just seems to essentially slowly go down so hopefully this video helps you out in your concerns about the durability of saddles if you don't mind smash that like button leave a comment below for the algorithm and consider subbing to the channel because i am so close to that 100k all right teach out